Sher Muhammad Abbas Tanikzai alias Sheru got training as a foreign cadet at the Indian Military Academy at Dehradun. Sheru is a top leader of the Taliban. He had joined the Afghan National Army as a lieutenant after passing out in 1982 after completing his training at the IMA Dehradun. He was selected for training at IMA after passing the examination of the Afghan Defence Academy. He was called Sheru by his batchmates during training. He was among the 45 cadets who received training in the Karen Company of the Bhagat Battalion of the Academy. In fact, several of the cadets from African and Asian countries have received pre-commissioned training at the Indian Military Academy since 1948. 80 Afghan cadets are receiving their military training at IMA at present. After the swift victory of Taliban, Sher Muhammad Abbas Stanikzai is expected to be a key player in the new government. He was a deputy foreign minister in the last Taliban regime. He is considered to be highly educated as he has passed out of the Indian Military Academy at Dehradun. On August 31st, the Ministry of External Affairs confirmed that representatives of India and the Taliban met in Doha, the first time since the Taliban took over Afghanistan. Last week, Stanikzai had tried to reach out to India, saying that the Taliban wants to maintain Afghanistan's trade, economic and political relations with India. Stanikzai also described India as an important country in the region. According to the MEA ambassador of India to Qatar, Deepak Mittal met Sher Muhammad Abbas Stanikzai, the head of the Taliban's political office in Doha, at the Indian embassy at the request of the Taliban side. Born in 1963 in the Baraki Barak district of Logar province, Afghanistan, Stanikzai is ethnically a Pashtun. When the Taliban came to power in 1996, Stanikzai served as Deputy Minister of Foreign Affairs and later Deputy Minister of Public Health. His daughter studied in the United States. In 2015 he took charge at Taliban's political office in Doha. Stanikzai as a Taliban envoy went to meet US President Bill Clinton in 1996 to ask the Clinton administration to extend diplomatic recognition to Taliban rule Afghanistan. It was the first time when Pakistan, Saudi Arabia and the United Arab Emirates recognized the regime. He has represented the Taliban in several rounds of peace talks with the US and the Afghan government. In 2016, he went to Beijing and met the Chinese leadership, establishing direct contact between the Taliban and China. After the US-Taliban agreement, he had been traveling to Moscow, Uzbekistan, China and other places. The buzz is that Sher Muhammad Abbas Tanikzai could be the Taliban's foreign minister again.